Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel again, Leto Rossonaro here with you guys, a very important Milan win today in the Champions League, 4 nothing against Dinamo Zagabria, guys, uh, a very uh, tough team, uh, we won against a team that had never lost in this, this season at home, uh, so it was important for us to have a good showing, uh, first half, Dinamo showing why they're a tough team, uh, not afraid to run at the defense, uh, creating some occasions that Rosano had to make some nice saves. It was a 10-minute 10 10 minute period in that first half where it seemed all Dinamo, but Milan settling in. They had started off well, then Dinamo came back, and then they came back, and uh, finally, uh, Gabbia scoring off a free kick, a nice diving header. one nothing for Milan. It was only a uh, second uh, appearance in the Champions League, and he scores the all-important one nothing goal. Uh, very, very good. So uh, they got halftime, one nothing up. Uh, they come back in the second half, guys, and that was the Milan show in the second half. Occasion on top of occasion, this game could have finished five, six, maybe even seven nothing, uh, guys. Uh, right off the bat, De Catala misses a great counter attack. Instead of passing it to Rebic, he decides to go for the goal. Uh, defenseman blocks the shot, I believe. Um, he feels the pressure. You can see he wants to score this goal. He wants to put it behind him. But uh, right now, guys, it's just not happening for him. Uh, he played 50 minutes. Some good, some bad. He was on and off. Uh, not a steady performance. But you could see that he has a lot of pressure on him. Um, Pioli takes him out, puts in uh, Krunic instead of him. And guys, after that, Milan score uh, the other three goals. Leao first on a sort of mix-up by the uh, defense. Theo almost touches the ball. He doesn't. The ball goes through for Leao all by himself. He wasn't going to miss that shot. 2 nothing Milan. Then a penalty shot. Uh, defender brings uh, Sandro Tonali down. Giroud steps up, scores a beautiful uh, penalty shot up, uh, up high in the corner. And then a own goal by the uh, Dinamo Zagabria um, defender. Uh, guys, after that, Krunic had a two-on-one and he got his shot saved. Uh, Rebic had a chance and he got his uh, shot saved. Giroud had a couple of occasions. Uh, great saves from the goalie off headers from Giroud today, guys. And so uh, Milan playing well. But even at that, guys, Dinamo still created some chances. I think that Turasano had to make uh, a couple of good saves. They had maybe six or seven shots on net. Uh, 10 or 11 shots towards the net. So uh, still a busy night for the um, Milan defense. A defense that was made out of Gabia and Kier. Had to make some changes because Tomori had the red card. Up front, he started with Rebic on the right. So um, guys, purely experimenting some stuff. Uh, it worked out well. A very important victory. Why? Because Salzburg lost to uh, Chelsea. So Chelsea will finish first in the group. Milan right now is sitting second, a point ahead of Salzburg. So uh, they're meeting Salzburg at San Siro next week. They only need a draw to pass to the next round. Let's hope they win the game and they don't play for the draw. Uh, Dinamo, unfortunately, will be eliminated from the Champions League. Will they participate in the uh, Europa League? It remains to be seen. But uh, Milan has a great chances to pass this Girone. Uh, let's hope they do it. Like I said, a very important victory today against a team who hadn't lost at home the entire season, guys. Let me know what you think. Write in the comments, like and subscribe. Forza ragazzi, forza Milan. Great showing today. Uh, pocherissimo alla Dinamo Zagabria.